Well, this is the turning just before the uh, Christmas storm uh, turning. later I'm still stuck but we can just see or I can just see police lights about 10-15 cars ahead of me <clears throat> well, I can see I can see a recovery lorry there's a couple of recovery lorries I can't see no it's stopped they've been letting people go through trickling through but now it's stopped. Stop this there. Okay, in a minute now the uh, the police are going to be bringing um, drinks and uh, snacks. They've been sitting there a while. Again I don't know what's going on. There's a guy standing at the end of the uh, recovery vehicle. Doing something. No, he's jumped off now. Are we clear? Can we go? Come on. No, it looks like there's a bit of action going on there. Policeman. Two policemen standing there with their hands in their pockets. Looking nice and relaxed. Right. So come up again. And we're on the move again. Ah, they're pulling a car up onto the transporter. <coughs> Definitely hit the central reservation there, it's all down as you can see, and that looks to me like it's a Volvo. Volvo stained glass everywhere. There we go. No other vehicle involved. So that was that on the A10 between where and what well, I say, Buntingford. Between Ware and Puckeridge. There you go, between Ware and Puckeridge. Now I'm stuck in traffic again because obviously it got down to the next next available roundabout and obviously they can't let traffic up the opposite side of the A10 so all the traffic's going round and it's either going to go left up on towards Wade's Mill or has to go back towards Buntingford. Big old chain reaction that crash. Big old chain reaction. Go to the roundabout. Ah, home here I come. That was exciting. 